And it's a big yes. Yes, 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 yes. I do have the Charade SCHF 55 B E A U T R F U L sexy as whatever knife. I'm not reviewing it yet. We've done quite a lot of testing on this, and for all you guys that have been following me and coming out doing a bit of testing, yes, it is by far my favourite charade knife that they've got on the market to date. Fixed blade, anyway. Without a doubt, this is kind of my style knife. It's perfect size for me. The handle's great on it. The sheath is awesome because it's left hand, right hand sheath. It's perfect. Tough as your boots. Oh, there she is. Oh, my goodness gracious. Fire. She is beautiful. Strikes a Phariseum rod. Griffin design. My absolute favourite knife by Charade. But, so deserve of a really good, nice, proper review with the music and all that. So I'm holding off from doing it. I'm kind of really enjoying using it myself. Kind of get a feel for it. I love it. The Charade. Let's bring you into range here. I have got the Charade. Catalogue. We're looking at the Tactical Survival Pen by Charade. We have, I have used this out in the field and it does work. I've actually managed to make a fire with it. Um, didn't film it. It's been so wet down here. We were just like mucking around with some loads of gear and we were just having some great fun with this. So I thought, you know what, we'll just do a little bit of a tabletop review on it and we'll talk about it and the key features of it, my experience that I've had with it, my fun that I've had with it. It is cool. It's, it's a kind of like something at a halo, really, you know. Absolutely brilliant. You can see, I'm going to cap it there. That's where your emergency whistle is. And that thing is flipping loud. It does work if you leave it on the pen. All this screws together. Kind of cool. Yes, sir. Cool as hell. But yeah, that, that is loud, that whistle. I kind of went out in the field and just... And give let rip with it and I couldn't hear nothing for ages afterwards. It is super loud. It does work. Brilliant. The pen itself is really cool. It does write good. <laughs> Hello. So you can just kind of have fun writing out stuff with it. You need to do drawing with it. Kind of smooth. It's not just awesome. You can see my kind of art talents here. We can do this stuff all day. My kind of... It's like brilliant. You know, because I've come a long way. I used to draw stick man. And you kind of master the stick man thing. You can kind of draw loads and kind of like a beautiful house behind but in our case we'll put a TP up that's my TP and we have a bit of smoke coming out of there so you know for any of you guys didn't know um, yeah I am a bit of an artist um, but anyway let's get back to the pen so it writes good it's smooth it's pretty cool everything inside here is changeable absolutely everything from the kind of ink cartridge fill there's your little ink cartridge that you've got you can buy the replacements um either from charade or i think there's a, quite a few other places that kind of do them um, 
all does up. It's got O-rings on it and all types of stuff to keep it watertight. The real business end is that you've got a, uh, a thing that with that on. It could be used as a breaker and it does work. I have used it for breaking stuff. It's good on slate and stuff like that. And it did clean off very well. I didn't get much wear on it. I got a little tiny bit, but nothing kind of major. If the camera will focus. The light's rubbish in here. The business end of things. On this, you can kind of make this into um, all types of weird and wonderful stuff. I put that on there and got that wrong back along. We were mucking around with it. Then we just left it like that, giving you the big handle we were playing around with it then we figured out that that was the striker and it's all in reverse so it doesn't come loose all this even your ferrule rod that you have in here which is a super good ferrule rod um super good it's reversed you've got to remember that this all does up in reverse so it doesn't come loose that comes out unscrews and you can replace it if you want to um, get the side that I've been striking, you get this cool striker, which without catching the plates on fire here. Yeah. Ooh, I'm gonna catch the plates on fire. Well, not. Why am I? Why don't work? Uh oh. It's kind of me on this angle. There we go. There we go. So we kind of this scraper is harsh. Ooh. But anyway. Oh, now we've got it. Oh, that's better. Once you get the angle right, it throws a mean spark. Just be really careful playing around with this inside the house. Because these things go rolling across the table. I know Cutlery Love had done a video on it. And he had sparks going everywhere. I, I do like to use the back of my knife. It's easier, in it? <laughs> it is easier to use the back of your knife than a little striker. These strikers are alright. But, if anything, they are really good on the charade ferrocium rods. The full ones are brilliant for that. Because it's like a tungsten or hardened steel. So they throw a hell of a spark. So if you've got like a charade ferrule rod and you use that, it's lethal. It works super well. On here it does work well, but you've got to get the right angle. And I'm like the wrong angle with the camera. I'm kind of behind the camera. It's quite hard work. Oh, let's do it all back together again. So there you are. The charade. Tactical survival pen. It's actually really cool. And the thing I like about it, the pocket clip does work exceptionally well on this. You've got the charade logo. Kind of looks cool as hell. But like I say, try not to play with it. It's it, you know inside inside the house or inside inside your office or whatever. It really isn't a toy. It does make fires. Um, We've been out and made fires with it, so just be cautious of that and watch out because when you throw a spark with it, they do roll across the tables in all types of weird and wonderful stuff. And it's when you kind of roll one right under the sofa over your house, so you've got to start worrying. Where did that go? So that's it, guys. That is the Charade Tactical Pen. Um, it's the SC Pen 4 series. Um, isn't that cool orange? They do do different colours on that. Um, so just be cautious of that. Let's just go through the motions one more time to see whether we can just kind of get it to throw sparks right away. I should try and get it a better angle here. There you go. Easy. So, it does throw a mean spark, just uh, get the right angle that you need. <laughs> so that's it guys, that's it from me, that's the Charade SC Pen for 
There's another look at the Charade SCHF 55. It's got a massive following. It's got a massive fan club. I have uploaded some pictures onto Facebook with it and it being in use. Um, I think the review will be out soon for that. Don't forget to check out the Charade. Facebook, Charade, YouTube, they do amazing giveaways. They really love feedback from you guys. Um, yeah, that's it. That's the Charade pen. Now I've kind of broke everything. Just remember it on your top bit is in reverse. That goes back together again. Move out. That's it. See you on the next one.